Welcome back everybody. In this video, I am going to show you how to use the distracting items feature in iOS 18.1 beta 2. And this will be rolling out to the actual public release of iOS 18 here in September. Let's jump into this. All right, first off, I'm gonna tap on Safari. I already have an article loaded up. So here you are, right? You're gonna read the article and for, for whatever reason, you're gonna to wanna to do this, right? So I'm over here, so I see that right there. And maybe later on, I wanna be sharing this with somebody. I don't know, I'm doing a presentation or something. Now you see that little thing down there? Tap on it right there. You're gonna see hide distracting items. Tap on that, tap on this. Now watch this. I don't even know how they're doing it. Watch this, hide, goes away. Then you just say done, right? You keep scrolling. Oh, hey, there's that. Tap down here on that, down there. Tap on this again. Hide distracting item. Tap on this. Hide. All right, so I'll probably, I want to, ah, what you got to do is cancel. Now we're going to do it again. You saw the little mistake I made there, right? So you kind of have to do this in order. That way you don't screw the whole thing up. All right, there we go. So you press done. Then you keep reading, right? So you see how that looks. So we'll go a little bit more, and there's another one. Now, I don't know who really needs to do this. I mean, I'm, I don't get that distracted by things like that, but I'm noticing people are excited about it for whatever reason. So you want to you want to go through all this, tap done. Then I guess you want to read without being distracted. But <laughs> to me, that's more of a distraction, you know, you know, hiding all the stuff that you're you shouldn't even be distracted by. So, okay, so there you go. For whatever reason, I guess, people want that, I guess, and that's fine. But say you want to, like, you know, undo it, you want to come over here. Now you can type show hidden items or say there was some kind of issue. Maybe it didn't work correctly. You can report the distraction control issue. Tap on that, boom, and you can record it, report it. Say it didn't work the way it was supposed to work, okay? But in this situation here, so you want to show the hidden items, so you go ahead and uh, tap it, and yeah, yes, yeah, so I want to show, and then they will all come back. So there they are right there, so now they're all back. You can see the girl all upset looking at her closet and all that stuff like this. All right, but I, I, you know, I can see, I guess, that it can be like a useful feature, because sometimes like whenever you have an ad and you tap on it, it still has the space where the ad was, so I get it. This can actually be beneficial in a way, so if you don't even want to see that for whatever reason, hide it done and you just no longer well now there's that so i guess you're gonna be you know getting rid of stuff that you're distracted by and that's great so anyway if you have any special requests uh let me know about it in the in the comments i'll make a special video for you but anyway this is how to use distracted items or distracting items let me look hide distracting items yeah so anyway yes yeah, so hopefully this video was helpful and i will catch all of you in the next one Take care.